Dad, I'm not a crazed gun mare. I'm an assassin. The difference being one is a profession and one is a mental sickness. A profession? A profession? We sent you to the most prestigious school of magic in the country, and the best you can do for money is shoot ponies? Hey, I'll have you know I am very good at my job. Efficient, polite, and I have planning skills. Sniping takes a lot of thought. What a nice way to say you try to save bullets and not get caught. And polite? What is so polite about throwing chars of... of... peanut ponies? That's just disgusting! It's... complicated. Look, my job is difficult. I make good money. I'm worth millions! Says the man who lives in a van. That's a matter of personal preference. I'm not saying your job is easy. I'm saying you've squandered your potential. You had high grades. You could have been a doctor, an engineer, but no! You shoot things for a living! And now this again. What would you have me do, Dad? Build fancy gadgets and awe ponies with miracles of modern science like Applejack and Fluttershy? That's exactly what I'd have you do! They may be criminals, but at least they are overachievers! The most ambitious thing you've done was make a gun that shoots pea-filled darts! It's basically you in a nutshell! You have no idea what I had to go through to get you into that school. I did things. Things I am not proud of. Things I will remember every time your mother tells me she loves me. Dad, put Mom on the phone. The shame of what I've done will never wash away. <laughs> Dear Administrator Celestia, I learned nothing about teamwork from this, as my so-called teammate, Red Pyro Pinky, kept on taking all my med kits. She's not even injured, and I'm right there being burned to death. If any pony should be doing constant cleaning duty, it should be her. I must leave now. There's a blue changeling spy waiting for my bullet to meet his skull. Your number one red sniper, Twilight Sparkle. <laughs>